Hundreds are gathered in St. Clair today sporting their red, white and blue and combining their love of fun in the water, poker and also all of this helping a woman in St. Clair with the recent loss of her husband. So today is our eighth annual Hope Floats kayak poker paddle um, over here at the St. Clair Boat Harbor. And this year the charity is going to Tracy Hewlett who lost her husband. My husband um, got diagnosed with pulmonary fibrosis. Um, he had been on oxygen since December 14th. Um, we went and saw the lung specialists at Henry Ford, the lung transplant team, and he went on the list. Middle part of April and was waiting for a lung and um, his health started to deteriorate and he passed away. Once he passed away, Diane went to the women's chapter and they still decided to do the event for me to help with any of my expenses afterwards. 150 registered today and then we've had people show up the day of also. We are launching over here at the St. Clair Boat Harbor Access and then they travel up the Pine River. The first stop is going to be at the golf course. We have designated people that pass out poker cards to each kayaker along the way. It's probably about a three mile maybe a little over, I don't know, we've never actually measured it, but uh, probably about a three mile journey and they come back around and then we do a lunch and raffles and 50-50, that kind of stuff. People pass out jello shots and fun stuff because they love seeing all the kayakers go by. What Women's Life does is they match the funds up to $500 for the event and then they will send a check to the person that the money is going to. For our um, Marine City Chapter Women's Life, our group is 821. We have a set amount of fundraisers that we can do with Women's Life a year. So this is one we always pick because this is just a, such a special event and people love this and every year it gets bigger. But we just try to stay in our community and help people in need. We got blessed to not have no rain after our monsoon so we're super excited about that because we've never had a rainy day ever. So this is just amazing the turnout of people and um, it's going to be a fun event. This event is a staple in the summer for this Women's Life chapter and they do events all year long including one to look forward to for the 21 and up crowd the santa pub crawl plans to return this year at riverview plaza for ebw tv i'm annie naraki